So today we're going to take a look at how you can install a NordVPN extension on your Google Chrome browser. So first off you're going to need to go to nordvpn.com. If you don't already have a plan with NordVPN you will need to get one of those. There's a variety of different plans from monthly, yearly and two yearly. Of course the longer you buy the cheaper it is. But after you've done that and you have an account I'm going to show you how you can install the Google Chrome extension. So once you've logged in and you come to your Nord account you're going to see here we're on the home tab. And on the right hand side you'll see a thing called download center if you don't actually see this the website has changed or something since this video you can just go across onto the left hand side and where it says nordvpn just click on that and it'll take you over here and you can just click on the right hand side download nordvpn for extension and it'll take you directly to the chrome one but if we're doing it on the download center we just click download apps go across and it might already suggest it for you here. As you see, it says try NordVPN for Chrome. We can click that, or if it's not there, just scroll down. And you will see a few different options there. Obviously, we want the Chrome one, so we're just going to click Add Extension. It's going to take us to the Google Chrome Web Store. We're just going to click Add Extension. And there's a click Add Extension again. Let it do it. And it's going to say NordVPN Proxy Privacy. So it has been added to Chrome. So now you should have your little NordVPN icon up here. It'll be great at the moment. If it's not there, just click this little jigsaw piece extensions and just click it on. Just pin it onto the tab. Once we've done that, we just click login. It'll take us to a new login page. Because we're already logged in, it'll probably just log us in. Just select your account and it says, great, you're in. So if we look now, we can click on our NordVPN. We're not connected. We can just click quick connect or select one of these countries here and we'll do that and give it a few seconds as you can see we're connected i'm in the uk so it's connected to me to one that's local so it's connected me to a uk one you can see that here by the little gb and of course you can see it here it says which one i'm currently connected to thanks for watching guys i hope this helps please like comment subscribe and i'll see you next time